I'm going to open this uh, Join the Hunt special report with one name. Robert David Steele. Robert David Steele. Now look at this. Uh, I just listened to a report, if I can get out of the sun here. Of course, I just picked up some pottery by Robert David, excuse me, Robert David Steele, and he was being interviewed. And I love being able to pick up different feeds and listen to insight from people who live in the world and study the world of uh, just serious uh, things that are happening. Uh, you know, there's there's never been a more diversified, never been a greater time. And look at these pieces I just picked up. Uh, to live than right now. But at the same time, this is a special report for Join the Hunt with Indian Trace because, as you'll hear in the link, political interest link, Robert David Steele knows what he's talking about. I double dog there. You just ask yourself whether or not this guy knows what he's talking about. But here's a nice handful of it all. The reason it's a special report is because uh, for me, it gives me a clear pathway to what I need to pray about. And I'm going to tell you what, if you do not believe and join the hunt here, I am still uh, just taking a little extra 20 minutes, 15 minutes out here, checking this area that they had to prep because it got washed out. Sorry about the focus. Carrying on here. But uh, I want you to join the hunt here with me. And uh, it's been great. I picked up a lot of uh, pottery and pieces of artifact here and there. And as I was going to say, i got to try to stay focused here because the link, the political interest link here is a special report. you got to listen to it. Uh, if you are subscribing or if you tune into Indian Trace for artifacts, I'm going to tell you what, there's plenty here. I find plenty. I love to share them. North American interest, uh, excuse me, Indian interest, I think is a vital interest uh, for people who collect artifacts. But more than that, for, for every single uh, citizen of the United States of America, we should understand the plight of the North American Indian, even the modern uh, needs for activism for them, for their rights. But if we don't pray to continue to affect and save uh, the freedom of this nation as we know it, uh, I mean, there's already troubles here. There's troubles, troubles coming, troubles that have been here. There was troubles on November 8th. It was prayed. I mean, it, it'll humble you to go back. Go to Bill Still. Just type in Bill Still and, and, and type in Israel. And you will see the nation of Israel praying for our nation on November 8th. Praying for God to intervene, for God's providence to get just a door open, such as in President Trump, instead of the overwhelming monsoon of corruption. But positively, Robert David Steele has an awesome report. What should I look at here? I'm just going to do another wave up this way. Uh, awesome report about, uh, people call it inside baseball. And really, uh, and Alex Jones often says that, and uh, it's going to be difficult if you're just a regular Joe like me or a regular person. I, I, it's not hard for me because I don't really subscribe to any uh, syndicated news channel. I use alternative news and I use many counselors and I contrast and uh, use layers of their reports and their understandings about what's going on to determine what's, what's true. And I listen carefully and I think about the words of leaders and primary source resource to, to, to formulate a heartbeat of how I, I need to move forward, how I need to pray. Now, Robert David Steele, and this is a special report, I don't, I, I haven't, actually, to this point, I've never made two uh, Join the hunts on Indian Trace. Never made two. Well, that's too bad. That didn't survive. Can you see it? Bulldozer. Too bad. Sort of say a silent prayer for that point. See the base? You see it? 
Oh, well, that's the way it is. Robert David Steele. Don't forget the name. The political interest link is here. And uh, the reason I want you to listen to it is, number one, so that you can join in prayer. I am convinced that the prayers that rose up out of the state and out of the nation of Israel. Uh, now, it's going to be a hard road to hoe if you actually tune into Indian Trace and you do not Sorry about the wind. I'm trying to push my voice out because I can hear the wind on my ears just whipping. So, uh, I'm pausing. <sighs> I don't want it to blow it out because this is really not going to be that long for a join the hunt. Uh, special report. Special lead. I was so impressed by the analysis of uh, this reporter. And I will consider the reports of many different reporters on subjects that have to do with uh, current events and what is actually happening. I mean, you're not going to hear on the modern news what is actually happening with the multiple, I mean, hundreds of indictments and arrests for pedophiles, uh, excuse me, for pedophiles across this nation. How sickening even high-ranking officials. Now, I've known since I went to graduate school that there is a black market for kids who are stolen and who disappear. I've known that. Uh, oh, people don't want to look at it. The news never wants to report on it. And I'm not going to talk about it here. It just doesn't need to be done. If you want to know, I double dog dare you just to search it out. It's something that's been happening in a disgusting fashion. And unfortunately, the whole barnstorm of problems with corruption in politics. Oh, people who think they have power got all caught up in it. In disgusting sexual perversion. Oh, Lord, help us all. But really, Robert David Steele's report is not about that in, in, in entirety. It's about the whole mind frame around it. It's about the whole system of thinking uh, that's going on right now. That, uh, I believe our president needs help with in terms of moving forward and making the right choices in prayer. Uh, and in every single time he wakes up, every single time he approaches the day with all the decisions and the choices he makes, this report, the special report, the political interest link here that I sort of, if I can reach two people, if I can influence 15 people to watch it, do it. It's vital. Uh, you know, I can't say much more about that uh, because, you know, um, <laughs> to me, I am blown away. I'm not blown away at the opposition. Even the Bible says in this world, you're going to have tribulation. You're going to have troubles. There is going to be wars and tribulation and rumors of wars and there's going to be more unrest civil unrest unfortunately because people actually uh feel it's a good idea to accept money and then go rip things up in protest and they're paid they don't have any persuasion they don't have any conviction inside that they're upset about as to the reason why they're going to marching or going to dc or whatever people don't even realize that a group has been hijacked by radicals and violent people who are paid. I don't hear or need to tell you who they're paid by, more than one organization. But, you know, it's, it's pitiful, I should say, saddening. But Robert David Steele's report, I want you to, uh, and we're going to finish this as I walk across, trace the ridge of this, I want you to give it a chance. Not because it's the best thing I've ever heard, but because it's just, I'm happy because it's another avenue for somebody who is well thought, well studied, deep study, who understands what's going on in today's American political scene. And it's really about America. America the beautiful, which is what the majority of people, you and I, want. But it's not going to come without labor. And as it's been said before, and that's why I always thank our veterans and thank our military, freedom is not free. It's not free. And so our responsibility in peaceful times like you and I might have today is prayer as well. 
the people on their knees and on their faces in Israel on November 8th, on that night will humble you to see them praying to God that the door would be open, that we would be delivered at least one big step from a complete broken, excuse me, corrupt system. And there was corruption that literally tried to steal the election from Donald Trump in seven ways to Sunday, even in the primaries. And there was complete corruption, even for those out there that are Democrats, that is proven, documented, and is a known fact that was stolen from Bernie Sanders. So we're moving forward. But listen to the special report from Robert David Steele. I think that's his name. It's on this. Uh, and you're going to be blessed, if not changed. I want you to be motivated to pray more with me because uh, it doesn't need to stop now. There's going to be some challenges, and there is already. But our leader is doing a good job. Don't be discouraged. Most of all, don't listen to the hype. Search it out for yourself. It's there. The good reports and the good decisions about what's happening uh, are there. The truth is there. So from Indian Trace to all you guys out there and girls, appreciate you tuning in. And this right here, well, this is a bunch of Indian Trace here because this is the kind of stuff you find out here. And I don't even think my focus is working. It's not, is it? I don't know if this thing focuses automatically. Well, let's move forward. I didn't like that very much. I'm not, I'm not happy at all when this, this phone doesn't work like my brain does or like my own eyes does. Our eyes are the best uh, camera that there is. So as I sift up here, oh, look at that. Look at that. Look at, oh my God. You see, you see, this is going to be great for you. I don't even know. I, I must have missed it 12 times. I'm looking at an arrowhead and I can't even believe it because I told you, I told you that we'd be walking along and I almost turned the camera off. I almost turned the camera. I'm not talking about something that's a G10 or what. I'm talking about a nice ancient Indian hunting point. I'm looking at it right now and I can't even believe it. I mean, I can't even believe it. Look at right here. I almost turned it off. Look at right here. So from all of this great stuff, even a broken heart, see this, see this, to that sitting there just on my way out. I might find another. It is never over until you leave the dirt. Please consider as we look at this, just taking some time and listening to the special report, the interview with Robert David Steele. I think that's his name. It's on here anyway. Look at that sort of a, a brownish rye light. Why not? Now, I'm just happy because uh, Join the Hunt Live, you know, we haven't started into the prime season finding artifacts, but that's a nice one right there. Why not? But I can tell you already, just looking at it, that's a gift. I love finding gifts anyway. It doesn't matter to me. That's a nice point. So I'll put it with all these, and uh, that makes it a, a, a happier time, funner time out here just to join the hunt. And I appreciate you joining the hunt with Indian Trace. And I hope you find out there.